ground stuff. Um. All right, we'll keep exploring. Telling you though, unless unless I got absolutely no choice, this is going to be one of the last times for quite a while that I'm going to come to one of these central labs. So I hope you guys are getting your fill. <clears throat> All right, uh, we got both south and east as options. Look south first. Three by three, the alternate three by three grid. Um, I don't want to trap myself without a way to go back, and if I light a fire, it's going to be burning for a while. And I'm not worried about the uh, the fungus anyway. None of the mobile stuff is active right now, so I'm not going to let light this on fire at the moment. And I might need that stairs down here shortly. Alright, see if our crate woes continue. <laughs> We've gotten damn near nothing out of these crates. And again, one of the rare sections with no, no light. I've never once seen a turret in these alternate 3x3 grids. Yet another. I got so much adrenaline. Why do I have so much adrenaline? So, not the funnel I need, unfortunately. <laughs> Just a standard funnel. It, it, it keeps teasing me with the standard funnels instead of the separation funnel. Autoclave. I'm not worried about the autoclave. I got no way to power it for now. Easy enough to come across at another time. Now we got nowhere to go but east or back to the north. Oop, you get my gun. Too slow. Should have pulp or should have uh, butchered them before I pulped them. <laughs> God damn dogs! Bad dogs! The hell, man! Oh, I'm not running. Thought I was running. sitting around. Who knows? Maybe we'll go medical and uh, I'll need all these drugs. Hmm. You first. You next. Alright. East and north. Let's go north first. No! <laughs> so many skitterbots. Let's see. I need to uh, make sure I got a clean retreat path and I got a good line of sight. Let's go. Oh, I should have gone. Should have gone east. Still sort of can. Let's use the chain link to our advantage here. Hey there, Mr. Skitterbot. for me. Um, <laughs> damn, the man hack. Thank you very much, Mr. Man hack. the plutonium I've been looking for. 
I guess that answers my question from Wednesday. I had asked, do uh, the mechanized still drop plutonium? As it answered. Crate love is still not on my side. kind of just working my way around the outside edges here. Endpoint? Oh, this is the doctor's office section. So this is where I would really love to have that uh, phase immersion suit on, because I'd be completely immune to the shock zombie. And all these other little tiddly things. But no, I had to take hooves. that room way south here whoops but we had a way south back there I miss that ah god damn it bad let's see you gotta go first There I go shooting lights out again. <laughs> I just hate these things. So many bullets to kill these tiny little guys. stairs back down. Let's take me anywhere I haven't been. Yep. <laughs> oh, wait. I, I can't know that because my map memory is gone. Um, I, I, I don't think I've been here. Oh, never mind. I have been here. Just a library. God dang it. Trying to get over there to shut the door. He pops back out and tags me again. Well, it's one of the other big differences. If you're not familiar with those super lab complexes or the central labs, notice all the lights. Everywhere is lights. Lights, 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 lights. Lots of lights. So you can't hide in the dark areas like you can in the regular labs. And uh, lots of robots, tons and tons of man hacks and skitter bots, and also wandering bio operators for some reason. Yeah, another three by three. Please don't be full of robots again. Slow again. Really? Now we can go back to the west? Uh, okay. Containment room. Another bongo player. goo canister <laughs> again the most powerful weapon in the game a 
but I really never end up using it for anything. So I've already got one or two laying around. Oh, that's not good. That could be dangerous right there. Flood broke the door. All right, also not good. <laughs> it's just leading me on this little S curve around and around, not getting to an end point like I expected. Bio operator. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Uh, first aid kit. More MREs. Static powder. And I don't care about the rats. Do we butcher? Or do we do we dissect? I've just about got my fill of Mark II power storages from all the bio-operators in this place. Still, probably quite a few of the higher end CBMs he could have, and I'm I'm kind of looking to uh, tire myself out anyway. So, uh, are all the lights broken in here? Oh, all right, where are you? Whoa, look at that! We just mutated again. Poor sensitivity went to very poor. Uh, EMP projector. Well, that's useful. That's one I was hoping to have earlier. Assuming I ever get a chance to actually clean these stupid things. Which is not likely. But at least this one we don't have. <clears throat> yeah, another. Mouse! <laughs> Here we go again! Damn man, Hicks! Pits and dissectors end yet again. One way to go. Uh, I'm getting a little nervous about this. Look at this craziness. All right, what are we up to? What are we? Are we? Are we hat on, hat off? <laughs> I know there's been some more hat activity. You guys just don't want me to be able to keep track, huh? <laughs> a little, little triple score for the rescue there. All right, I'm just gonna keep going. If if it settles down and it's uh, hat off time, somebody somebody ping me. Hey, look at that! We finally got to the end point. So they built an end point. Whoops. Four, four rooms deep, five rooms deep, one, two, three, four, five, just to get to this, uh, it could be any of them. Well, it's either barracks or prisoner containment. Prisoner containment, eh. Uh, 
Alright. Yeah, we got some tram at all at least. So, that was quite the side trip just to get to a uh get to ten tram at all in a prisoner containment. Yes, Mr. Bongo, I know you're excited. Long way back. Alright, <laughs> now we can start making progress again. Quite the little tail. We have been skipping these interior connectors, like up here, for these rooms and these rooms. We're just kind of making a big circle at the moment. Little peek. Which one we got? Radio room? No thanks. <laughs> uh, so hate these little guys. Open door, get shocked. Oh, another auto dock. Hey, Nursey. Whoops. Trying to shoot the wrong thing. God dang it. Ah, uh, these things are so annoying. Good bot or bad bot? Oh, must be a good bot. <laughs> Come on. Um, and Hack's going to interrupt me while I'm trying to shoot the skitter bots. Here comes the interrupt. No useful items. All right, starting to get a little worried about my ammo supply again. <clears throat> yeah, still looking for the separation of funnel eater. Migo is pretty much the source of almost all the uh, the random sayings that you hear. Hey there, Lucas kid. Yeah, the Hat Wars are no, none of the stuff I've had on YouTube have had uh, access to the channel points conversations. So, the channel points and being able to spend those are newer than anything YouTube has seen for my content. So you wouldn't have any idea what's going on. <laughs> They're just a bunch of meanies. They want me to stare into these bright lights without the protection of my hat. And so they're they're insisting on giving me eye strain and headaches. 
But I've got my Valiant Defenders that are uh, preserving my eyesight to some degree. More fungal! Die fungal! Get away from me, spores! Alright, who broke the lights? And am I gonna get shot by a turret? Marlos Berries! Yeah, give me some Marlos berries. I'm yum. That's all the active ones. Can't go south. Oh, are we going to get zapped again instantly? Not an acid zombie. Whoa! Whoa! That's not good. Alright. Crappity crap. Is he going to blast me before I get the headshot? Yes, he is. <laughs> Alright, that was a whole hell of a lot more damage than I expected. Um, yeah, we've been in this situation before, and I can't get shots off fast enough. Let's see. Hmm. Problem is the aim time. <laughs> yep, yeah, it's the aim time. God dang it, thought that would get him right there. Probably would have been better to uh, back off. Eh, maybe put him into the uh, the dissector. When he's on top of me like that, I'm going to take damage pretty much no matter what. He hits pretty fast. He swings really quickly, so you can't get a lot of aiming off. I was only able to get two or three pulses of aiming, whereas the dog, for example, I was able to aim like ten times in between each of his his attacks. So that hurt. That, that kind of sucked a lot. And gave me a lot of pain I didn't want. Let's hit the trim at all. Slather on some more bandages. Uh, actually, do we still have... Yep, heads are still in shape. Alright, everything's fixed up. Pain will come down. Oh, they're out of back. So we're pretty well set on uh, on, this, on anesthetic. And that puts me over. Anything in there with you? Nope. Alright, where are we? I'm waiting for it to wrap back around <laughs> so we can connect up to this area. Uh, I don't know if I can wait that long, though. We do have another door south. Now we're going to have to wait even longer before I'm going to be able to have a chance to uh, do more, more investigating or more uh, auto dock, eh, more CBM removal. Oh, 
stop giving me the stuff I don't need. One of the rooms where I could get it, I just refuse to give it to him. Samples. Let's get shocked. Oh, unfortunately, we made it. Purifier serum, please. Nope. <laughs> they really want me to go insect and trog. Stop giving me insect and trog. South. It's gonna be another one of those weird pathways to a endpoint room. No, it's gonna be a short pathway to an endpoint room. <laughs> Body is, I think, on the uh, the machinery there. But it's not going to show it to me. Can I drag it out? Nope, can't drag it out. Well, that's interesting. Huh. So you can walk across it, but if a, if a thing dies on it, we're, uh, you're stuck without whatever the loot was. Oh, uh, and we got a bite. <laughs> Good job. Alright. Being a little too footloose and fancy free with my run around. Speed is down because of the pain. Yeah. Alright. Down to below a hundred ammo. got a long way to hook up to that northern section there. So, it's one of those potential turret traps right here. Nope, no turret trap this time. No alcohol. Alright, are we on another endpoint? No. Plant serum?
love the random bio operators. Is that going to be a dog kennel things are breaking out of? Sort of. More first aid kits and number eight, huh? A little heavier than I like. <laughs> Another power stored. No thanks. Barracks. Barracks. Well, so we got another endpoint section. So we have to go all the way back up to here. All the way back over here, work our way north. That's still a long chain of uh, things to go before I get back to that stairs there. Um. Still stuff in barracks I would like, but I don't think in my current weight and uh, damage levels I should go in here. So we're going to leave that one marked. <laughs> wow, now we're ramping things up. <laughs> uh, hmm. I could keep range, we could drop him, no problem. But uh, starting at 10, that's uh, get shocked range. What I'm not seeing is a door or a door. So we don't technically need to do anything in this room. Be nice to kill him and uh, butcher him or dissect him for possible CBMs, but um, not in this circumstance. That is not a healthy combination there. Just leave him alone. If it was dark, he'd be easy in a normal lab. But because we're in a central lab with a million lights, we don't have that option. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to go through and there's going to be a shock of brood in here also hiding in the smoke. Oh, it's a smoke zombie. <laughs> All right. Wasn't expecting a smoke zombie. I thought it was a smoke vent. And more tough zombies coming. kind of happy there's no way east from here
Finally got a CBM to pop out of a crate and turn out to be a weather reader CBM. Hmm. It's not a turret that killed that unless it magically phased the bullets through the window. No. Nope. Killed you, Mr. Technician. None of the other doors are open. Uh, I've already got eight electronics. I don't know if that might have recipes I need or not. But it's too heavy. Leave that behind. We're already at eight electronics. It up for just a second. Read it. What do you got? Anything special? I really, really want to make sure I have. Mm -hmm. The welding rig. On the lamp. Ah. Uh... <laughs> the, yeah, the Faraday chainmail suit. Yeah, we'll keep it for the moment, but we might we might have to ditch it. Oh, the machete. Surprise, it's the first one I've come across so far. Oops. Just about got me. <laughs> That's what the man hack will do it for him. Thanks. Guess now we know what killed the uh, technician. Um. I don't think I've dissected the technician yet. Let's see if we can get one of the utility CBMs. Nope. I, actually, I think this is the second one I've test I've dissected, and we failed all four possible CBMs. No, I don't want east opportunities. No north? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hmm. Do I have to go back to that one? Oh. The end point. Yay! <laughs> Which one? Barracks again. Alright, at least it's not a long diversion. Ah, too many damn bullets. I love it. I'm shooting him actively, and he decides to run away. Go, go towards the other shooting of bullets that are louder than my shooting of bullets. <laughs> uh, weird. And I shoot the light right next to me. <laughs> it's like five shots to kill this stupid guy. Now I'm actually getting pretty worried about my ammo supply before we, we re-up my ammo here. I need to get through at least, what, four or five more rooms? One, two, three, four more rooms at a minimum. Uh, I'm tempted to go peek at these three rooms before I keep heading north, but... Room. Nothing useful there. This is one of the rooms I need. But again, eh, there's pure fire and yet more insect. Whoa! Hey, buddy. Yeah, there's ten extra rounds. Oh, I had that extra magazine. What about that? And power storage. <laughs> Again, 
Again! With the funnel! <laughs> Stop it! Separation funnel! And no way north? Uh oh. Um. So yeah, this is just uh, one floor of this stupid lab. We've already done that floor, or most of it. I suspect there's more to it that I just have to find other stairs to get to. And there's the floor we're doing currently. Um, don't care about any of that. Can't go that way, so only choice we've got. <laughs> they they suckered me in. <laughs> they showed me a dead skitter bot so I would come in just to get me tagged by the live one. Yep. <laughs> God damn it. Stop it. Little bastards. Uh, good job. Good job. Nope. All right. Well, we know what's there. <laughs> Uh, I guess we're not going to look in that room. Still no way north. I'm really tempted to go fill in those two rooms since I can't go north from here. Stupid radio rooms. <laughs> well, that's that trap room I keep bringing up as a potential danger spot. <laughs> nice. Nice positioning on that one. Usually I end up seeing it from the other direction. And I, I mention it regularly. <laughs> sure we don't get another one. So usually it's this side that I come at from. This is where we've got the two doors over here, one with a refrigerator, one with a bathroom, and I constantly mention this is a potential trap room with the, uh, the turret corridors when you see this configuration. So that would be the trapped version of it right there. Interesting placement for the turret there. Usually it's a little more centrally located, and I don't see it from that spot. But... Alright, so note trap turrets. I remember that. Let's do the old danger signal. Uh, I'd like to put one on the other door, but I can't get across to it from here without going around a bunch. So here. Alright, so I still haven't connected to the north. And there's no door up there, so I still have to come over and then up. We know this is a 3x3 three three setup. I backed up and reset my movement points before I did that. That could have gotten me killed right there, too. Don't do things like step onto a counter, then open a door and move, just in case you absorb all your movement points before you uh, get a chance to back up again. Damn lights! <laughs> I'm going through so many bullets just uh, shooting lights on accident. Used to be I couldn't hit them for nothing. Now, I constantly shoot the damn things. Alright, we're getting, we're getting close. That's a little more convenient. Just keep giving me big rooms like this.
<laughs> Again? Alright. Uh, yeah, interesting. There we go. We have completed the giganto circle <laughs> of floor three of this uh, particular central lab. Now, theoretically, we'll be fairly clear. I don't know if it's this stair or this stair I need to get to. But we're not going to mess around. We're just going to go right for it. Uh, we haven't finished this floor either, have we? Lovely. Um... Shock prep. Maybe that's why I didn't go that way. I'm a little worried I've left something loose that I ran away from previously. Yet another funnel, just to taunt me with my lack of separation funnel. Alright, so just north of me... Yeah, we, we got a whole bunch of areas we haven't covered over here. Whoops! Oh, that's that one I played with so much. Alright, good. I remember that spot. So this should be... Could be a good spot for us to travel. Where am I? <laughs> uh, where am I? That corner. All right. So we just need to go over, over, over. Um, turret here. I'm assuming. Yep. So this area should be pretty clear. We've gone back and forth through here. As long as I don't walk into a turret. Uh, sweet. That's, that's quite the trip. But we're back at base. <laughs> so, oh man. I miss my map memory though. <laughs> Place is so big you just can't keep it in memory. All I can really go by is, uh, which sucks, is, uh, yeah, this, this is going to be a nightmare trying to explore this place. I'm so wishing I had that last tool so I could get out of here. Alright, let's drop some stuff. Gotta keep my box, of course. I uh, don't need plutonium, no. Lots more serums. At least we added some Marloss berries. Oops. Bring that filthy M4. Alright, uh, before I forget, get up our info supply. Oh, 300 randoms. <clears throat> Alright, so we got two fully stocked mags and 330 extra rounds. Our Gorman solution. Our nail knuckles. Our gears, eh, okay. I need to hop into another armory. Next armor we go to, we'll swap out our pants and jacket again. Still gotta take the jackhammer with me. 
I think that gets us back to our normal travel. Um, put the ACOG scope on now. I was hoping for more fish mutagen. I wanted to give another shot to get my my receptors back, or uh, the robust genetics, of course. But we we haven't come across any yet, other than that one dose. Actually, I haven't been paying attention. Did we get something? No, it's been it's been pretty mild. Very poor sensitivity. Smelly. My hooves. Wait, something. <laughs> I've only got Drunk Master and Self Defense as good ones now. Is that really all I had? I know we had Fast Healer that went somewhere. Uh, we don't know. I don't remember where. I never did figure out where my Fast Healer trait went. Or when it mutated and then got purged. Tail's gone completely again, yeah. But that wasn't a positive. I'm trying to remember what I started with. Pop open an earlier uh, video real quick. Ew, I had... I guess it was just Fast Healer. Only three green ones I had at the very start was Drunk Master, Fast Healer, and then the Self Defense, of course. So... Alright, that's fine then. I would love to make some Mutagen Punch. Although I'd like to actually craft the mutagens <laughs> that would go into the punch, which is where I'm stuck currently. So, we're doing fine on medicine and first aid gear. We're staying ahead of that curve. Uh, small group of books. I don't care about ninjutsu right now. Battery system, climate control, power storage. None of those are going to make a big difference right now. Teleport. We got six Mark II power storage, so that's what, 1500 power there, plus another 100, 1600, plus the 100 I got, 1700. We're only 400 power short of having the max that we can we can install anyway. So, I guess if I've got space, I'll grab the next two Mark II power storages just to top it off. But um, that's, like I said, assuming I do put together a vehicle auto dock or autoclave cleaning system. So none of that's going to make a big difference right now. Um, I'm afraid to use any of this stuff without robust genetics. We've got two serums again to keep ahead of any nasty stuff it hands me. Tonium, and that's about it. And plenty of food. Alright, so big thing is just to heal up. I'm just going to read something for a little bit, and uh, we'll do some training and uh, get a good night's sleep. Hopefully we can max it out and do some more CBM removal. I want to finish off the last few negative CBMs. We're just down to these four. So, let's read. Launchers? <laughs> I guess it's going to be launchers. That or I have to find something to craft to get my fabrication up. What do we have for fab? We're at fab 3 and 1%. And... I forget. It's the level 3 to 4 item. Smoothers. No yeah, wooden clog. Let's, uh, let's do some wooden clogs. Go, healing, go. Oh, whoa, wait, what? What? Very fast metabolism. Oh, they're going to do that to me. They're going to make me an extreme metabolism carnivore. That's what I expect. That's how genetic chaos usually bitch slaps me. Is It starts to say, ah, things are going too easy. Here, have extreme metabolism carnivore while you're trapped inside of a lab. <laughs> That's what we're going to get. 
All right, so we got uh, we got our fab. So now I can uh, I can just go ahead and uh, read my book from here. Get it all up. All right, hey, just Drew. Thanks for the prime sub. What are we up to? Can't see that. Seventy something percent on the goal. I I don't know. I can't see the number. <laughs> Little preview window I have is too tiny for me to see what that bar says. Alright. Um get a refresh on the head. I need some more disinfectant. Come here, first aid kits. Five first aid kits. Let's just do this one. See if we lose the thing I care about. Gauze and tape. Alright. That's alright. Very hungry, are we? Let's have that. That. Finish off the little stuff. Nope. Don't eat the fish, Vorm. Do not eat the fish. Alright, now we can get our fab. 20 minutes minus 2 with chemical warfare, or 30 minutes with no minus. We're going to go with the 30 minutes. Actually, yeah, it's not overly concerned about it. Uh, we are tired. We should get enough healing that uh, when we sleep. Whoa! Yes! Yes! There you go, Cataclysm! Now you're having fun! <laughs> oh! You piece of crap, Cataclysm. I, it loves to give me this stupid trait. It loves to hand this thing out. <laughs> what is it with this trait? Is this thing weighted to be handed out more often? <laughs> it's not just me, right? You regulars? Every time I run uh, one of these mutation things, <laughs> it seems to hand this to me. Uh. <laughs> uh. Oh, very poor mana sensitivity, very fast metabolism, and no mad. <laughs> I, I, I don't think it starts building up the negative until now, now that I have it. But it's gonna, it's gonna, it's, it's not gonna cause super big problems because I'm not doing a lot of crafting right now or, or anything. But uh, yeah, so I'm not gonna get rid of it. I'm not gonna purge just for the nomad. We'll wait for the next nasty thing for genetic chaos to be handed to me, and uh, then I'll think about it. <laughs> 